Hello, welcome back. With more Ace Attorney. Actually, the, I probably never put it clear in the last video, but I actually have all three games. I have the whole trilogy. We're just starting with the first one. We'll go in order. I'll take breaks in between them. And don't worry, I'm still doing my other games. I'm still going to do my Hollow Knight every so often. I still gotta edit those. I'm still going to post Minecrafts whenever the heck I get those edited. Still going to do my Celeste. Still going to do Persona and all those other games. So y'all can chill. And no one comments, really, but if there is a comment, if by the time this is posted, uh, then, uh, yeah, there, there, there you go. Now, I'm gonna quickly just... Alright, we did the trial, so we can save at the top again. There we go. Right? I hope you see the importance of evidence now. Also, hopefully you realize things change depending on how you look at it, at them. People, too. You never really know if our clients are guilty or innocent. All you can do is believe in them. And in order to believe in them, you have to believe in yourself. Right? Listen, learn, grow strong. Never let go of what you can believe in. Never. Well, I think our work here is done. Shall we be off? Yeah, I, I guess so. Say, how about dinner? On me? We'll drink a toast into innocent butts. So weird saying his name. I don't think I'm saying it correctly either. Oh yeah, face cam's still not working, by the way. Yeah. Oh, speaking of Harry, you were saying part of why you became more was because of him. Mm, yeah, part at least. You'll have to tell me more about it sometime. Maybe over drinks. Okay, sure, whatever, lady. I'm too young to drink, and I don't want to drink because drinking is bad. Unless it's Hawaiian punch or coffee in a can. I mixed those it up. And so, my first trial came to the point. Harry slapped me on the back and said, Gee, Nick, it's good to have friends. <laughs> but I'm pretty sure he's not gonna pay us. Unless you give, unless you count the clock up. He gave me a. I didn't know it then. But that clock was soon gonna be at the center of another incident. incident. And I promised to tell the chief about me and Larry. Would be one promise that I wouldn't be able to keep. Oh gosh. Uh, okay. Okay. I should have ended off this episode like this, but like it was going long, so like I didn't. Brand new episode has been added. Do you want to save your progress up until this point? Yes. And now we save at the first thing again. Now we're on episode two. Ring, ring, beep. Hello, this is Maya. Hey, Maya, it's me. Mia, what's up? You haven't called in a while. Sorry, I've been so busy. How you been? Well, lonely. <laughs> it's all your fault. Nah, I'm just teasing. It's been great. I'm finally getting used to having my own place. That's good to hear. Actually, I'm calling for like a favor to ask. I know, I know. You want me to hold evidence for you. Sharp as always. There's a lot of buzz around upcoming trial. I just don't feel safe keeping all the evidence here. I gotcha. So, what's it this time? It's a clock. A clock? Yeah, it's made you look like that statue, the thinker. And it tells you the time. I thought you might like it. You always like toys. Hey! I don't think a girl anymore says. Now, now. You know, I'm only teasing. I should probably tell you, the clock isn't talking right now. Huh? It's not working? That's lame! I had to take the clock look out. Sorry. I put some papers inside instead. Papers? Is that the evidence, then? Well, there's a possibility that it might turn out that way. Yes. Can you come by the office tonight? 9 p.m.? Or 9 a.m.? I don't know which, just at 9? It doesn't say. I don't specify, but just at 9 to pick it up. I'll be in, I'll be in a provincial meeting until then. Be pre-trial meeting. Sorry, my apologies. Okay, sis. I expect dinner. Something good. Like burgers. I could be really good to go for a good burger. Okay, okay. We'll hit the usual joint. Alright, it's a deal. Okay, sis. See you soon. Yep, I'll be waiting. Bye. 
Okay, it says like sister trial or something, so I'm worried about what's gonna happen. Beep. Conversation recorded. September 5th, 9, 27 a.m. September 5th, 8.57. Faye and Co. Law Offices. Now it's Faye. I'll take what's mine, the papers. I'm sorry, but I, I can't give you what I don't have. Miss Faye? You are a poor liar. Well, I see you right over there. That must be the thinker that swallowed those papers. How could you know? <laughs> You're not, you are not conspicuous to my background. Gathering information is business, you see. I should have been more careful. <laughs> my dear Miss Fay, I'm so very sorry. But I'm afraid I must ask for you one more thing. Your eternal silence. Oh, farewell, Miss Fay. What? What the heck? Red, white, blue. September 5th, 9.08 p.m. Fay and Co. Law Offices. Oh, I'm late. Eh, that's strange. Guess the chief left without me. She said her sister was coming away, so I should be out for dinner. What's that smell? Blood? Mia? Maybe she's in her office. Ooh, we already have to save. Turn about sisters. Okay. So we we always okay. It's, it's see, I'm assuming that we always get to see who the actual murderer is. Because if we didn't, then we'd probably kill all these trials. <laughs> Examine. Oh boy, that can't be good. I have to check uh, to see if he is okay. Oh boy, this can't be good. I have to check him. Move. Office? Yes, move to the office. What smell? Blood! <laughs> Sis? Someone's there. Chief? Chief? Chief! Oh no! No! She was so helpful! She's already dead! Who are you? Um... Is she okay? The strange girl dropped out cold. I left her lying on the office sofa. I went back to Chief where she was laying under the window. His body was still warm. F I could feel it when I held her shoulder. Then all too quickly it began to fade until she finally went cold. Chief? Okay. The shards of glass are scattered around the floor. I'm seeing the beat remains of a glass shard lamp. Sand. I'm trying to read this first. No clues here. I like seeing her like this. Are there any clues here? She was struck on the head with a blunt object. Probably died instantly. The thinker, lying next to her, must have been the murder weapon. Again! Looks like a statue, but it's actually a clock made by Larry Butts. There are glass shards near the chief's body. Oh, pieces of. Okay, yeah. Glass shards with the broken remains of the glass stand, broken beyond all recognition. Nothing else that seems like a clue in here. Hmm? A piece of paper. It must have fallen from Mia's hand. Could be there. A word of, is written in blood on scrap paper. That's your sister, Maya. Did Mia write this? This paper is a receipt from the department store dated yesterday. The department store receipt with letters written on the back of it with blood. I think that's enough sneaking around for now. I better call the police. Let's find out what that girl is doing here. Ironic, this became a warrior weapon again. I know. That girl just now. Where'd she go? I put her right on the sofa. Uh oh. I'm seeing her run on me. Yipes. 
scare me like that. Um, excuse me, but who are you? It's okay. I work here. Maya. Maya Faye. Maya Faye. Maya. Maya. Maya is the girl's name. Maybe I should show her the sheep. I never thought there'd be Edison outside the courtroom. I'm saving. I'm saving. I'm saving. <laughs> I saved in the same slot, but doesn't matter. Help. What happened? She seems to be in shock. I don't want to disturb her, but I have to know. Excuse me. Can you tell me what happened? He came in. The room was dark. And this, this, is already dead. You and the chief. So, you're the chief's sister. I'm a younger sister. And you were here visiting? It's late at night. Yes. She said she wanted me to keep some evidence for her. Evidence? Yeah, it, it was that clock. The, it was the thinker? Okay, present. Before Maria died, she wrote this message in her own blood. She wrote it on the back of her seat. Mm -hmm. that, that's my name! Why? Why would she write my name? Please just calm down. The poor child! Why would this write my name? Uh-oh. Now I've done it. Better hurry up and call the police. Uh, examine? There's nothing to examine in here. Move. Court record. The thinker. The, the thinker. That that was. Oh, yes. <laughs> Did you know about this? This was lying next to Chief. I know. I saw it there too. I thought it might be pieces of the light scan. Maybe. Never heard of a glass light scan before. Book, everything is written, and she's alternate hair writing. It's a small office, but it makes good money. Okay, it's gone. Right! I better call the police. That's fine. I fear the screws on a receiver are missing. Looks like someone was halfway through taking that apart. Police? Please, come quick. What was that? Someone screaming from the outside window. She's staring right at me. She's holding a phone in her hand. I want to see this guy who does not use it. No clues here. Surprisingly, the chief was ever good with machines. Almost uh, about all she used as a PC was her email. She picked up the ancient mod on the garage chair and practically nothing. Okay. Chief's chair, simply functional design. Feel free to design too. Um, I don't really know what else to do. Some ladies after me. The large building, a large building right across from the office. The Gateway Hotel, a nice luxurious place. Looks like she's yet. Yeah. Uh, is there anything else I can look for food? Oh, books, books. All the chief's important documents are packed in here. This is what she filled her case reporting the reason we wins. Um, okay. So I guess we move. I'm gonna save again real quick. There's really no point in doing another save file at this point, so should be fine. Back, move, back into the office. The police! Sounds like they're coming this way. Freeze, police. All right, I'm Detective I, I can't say your name. I'm just gonna say Richard Gumshoe. See? Gumshoe? What an odd name. We've refu we received the report from the building across the way, see? We've got a person saying they saw a murder. It must have been the woman I saw. Anyways, I don't want either you moving one inch, okay? 
Great, just great, Maya. Wait, she wouldn't have. What? Uh, excuse me. This bird is Maya here. Doesn't mean anything to you. Oh, um, that, that's that's my name. What? Don't yell at her. The victim knew this here in a note with her own blood. See, with her dying breath, she wrote down the killer's name. Killer? Not. Case closed. You're coming down. That's so stupid! You can't just do that right away! You gotta look at the other evidence, you dummy! What? Maya's younger sister, Mia's younger sister, Maya, was arrested on the spot. I was taken in for questioning and didn't get out till the next morning. My eyes were heavy, but I couldn't sleep. I sat around waiting for visiting hours and began the detention center. I had to talk to Maya as soon as possible. September 6, 907. Detention center. Visitor's room. Wow, they have a- <laughs> Poor Maya locked up like a criminal. Poor Maya, man! She didn't even do anything! It's you! A lawyer! Good morning! Good morning! She looks so tired. Um, are you going to be my attorney? Well, that's what I wanted to talk to you about. I want it to be up to her. It's up to you. I better give it to her straight. It's up to you. To me? Yes. I don't think it's something I should decide. After all, you're the one in trouble here. They're never gonna believe me, are they? Even you. When you found me in the office, you looked at me like I had done it. Did I look like... Did I look at her like that? I don't think I did. No, no, I never saw it. It's okay. I understand. And I've always I've also heard about you. Heard. Heard about me. I was talking to my sister on the phone the other day. Today was my junior partner's first time in court. Wow, really? How'd that go? It was quite a scene and honestly, I was on edge the whole time. It's been a while. <laughs> so he crashed and dirt? He's a genius. One of those strike fear into the hearts of evil types. The only thing he's lacking is experience. Huh. Sounds like fun. Well, I know who to go to if I ever get into trouble now. I don't know, Maya. I think you might want to wait. Give him three more years. That is, unless you want to be found guilty. That's what she said. I I'm sorry. I didn't mean to insult you. I don't know, it's okay. It's true, I guess. But at the same time, I can't just sit by and watch. When I think of the person who did this to me... I know... Maya, there's something I've been wanting to ask of you. Yes? What's with the opera? Oh, this? This is, um... A cult he's wear. My uniform, you could say. A cult he's like people in really just train in? What is it you do? Oh, it's nothing strange, really. I'm a spirit medium in training. A spirit medium? I'm pretty sure that qualifies as strange. Um, spirit medium. So you're in a cult case, or medium in training. That's right. The Faye family, especially the women, have always been very sensitive to the spirit world. You said, you said Faye family. So Mia was into that stuff too? Of course. She left the mountain to follow her career, she said. She was her first class too. I had no idea. This is all new to me. Hmm. Wait. What? So you're real. Eyes to goodness spirit medium. But ESP and all that. Yes. In training. Oh, can't you contact Mia's spirit then? I just asked her who killed her. I I'm sorry. I'm still in training. I couldn't do something like that. Mm -hmm. oh, well. mm -hmm. I thought it would be too easy. Okay, day of the crime. I'm getting spammed with random Xbox notifications. It's very terrible. Could you tell me about the day of the murder? Yes. Let's see. That morning, 
I got a call from my sister. She wanted to hold on to a piece of evidence in for an upcoming trial. Evidence. Yeah. The clock shaped like the thinker. The one Larry made. How could that be any evidence in a case? Um, right. She said something about that. Um, I remember. Do you want to hear it in her own voice? Her own voice. Yes. I'm pretty sure our conversation is on my cell phone. You recorded it? Yeah. I forgot how to delete those things. Your your cell phone. Hand it over. <laughs> I'm gonna constantly save. I apologize. I think it's annoying. So you say you have a conversation with yourself or on your cell phone. Let's hear it. Right. Oh. I just remembered that detective took my cell phone. Sorry. Oh, right. Next time I see detective. <laughs> can't word. Next time I see detective detective Gumshoe, I'll ask him for it. Write your notes so you don't forget, okay? Sure, thanks. Mm -hmm. Maya's memo and added to court records. Mm -hmm. Um, huh? Something matter. Um, I was wondering, can I ask you a favor? This is the address of a famous lawyer. My senior gave me this a long time ago. She said if I was ever in trouble, I should call him. And, well, I'm in trouble. You can easily ask him to represent me. Say, what about your parents? I, I see, don't worry. Leave it to me. Thank you. The trial's tomorrow. 10 o'clock. What? Tomorrow? Tomorrow. What if the guy refuses? You told me if I don't find one, the state will pick an attorney to defend me. One more has happened. They're giving me until 4 o'clock this afternoon. And visiting hour is almost up. I better hurry. Right. I'll be back. Present. Okay. This guard monitors the visiting room. He hasn't moved an inch. A real pro, this guy. Anything else in here? This is my old pro, the camera. Um, this. September 6, Ghostbridge Law Offices. According to Retiptionist, the big boss is out. She couldn't say when he'd be back. Um, it must be hard to keep track of everything when you're a famous lawyer. Not to mention running an office like this. I guess I'll wrap just have to come back later. I didn't read that. Expensive looking Mahamagi book shows. Mm, funny, they don't even look like they have been read. A solid mahogany desk. Wood's been polished but to a deep lustre. September 6th, Fan Co. Law Offices. The office is filled with police officers. They're busy searching for clues. Hey, you there! This is a crime scene, pal! No trespassing! Oh, sorry. Uh, I didn't. I don't I know you from somewhere? Wait, you're that butts guy, aren't you? No, I'm Phoenix Wright. How can anyone mistake me for Larry? Ah, guess I got the wrong name. Mr. Wright, sorry about that. And butts guy, he was the killer, and you're no killer, right? He was proven innocent. Um, right, and you were, uh... Uh, Detective Gumshoe, right? Um, Gumshoe, wasn't it? Richard Gumshoe? Right! At your service. Hang on! That's Detective Gumshoe to you, pal. Anyways, get the name right. Don't you be gone. Don't go calling me Richard. Hey, Richard, get over here. Yes, sir. Be right there. <laughs> Poor dude. <clears throat> You're her lawyer, right, pal? If you got business here, you'd better do it quick. Oh, he's in the Maya's lore. <sighs> okay. Uh, Mia Maya Mo. 
present. Bubba say, did you do an autopsy? Mm, you want to know the results, eh? Now, don't give me that look, pal. It's no use. You might have been your boss. Doesn't mean you get to have any special treatment. All right, all right. You can see the report. But that's all. Down with death. Nine o'clock. Cause it's a single blow, blunt drama. Death was instantaneous. Um, about Maya. Yeah, I'm looking forward to her trial. Sorry, pal. This is one trial you aren't gonna win. Why do you say that? The city's the prosecutor Edgeworth's on the prosecution. Edgeworth. I'm sure you know what that means. You being a lawyer and all. Prosecutor Edgeworth. Now that's right, pal. Mr. Miles Edgeworth himself. Wait, you know him, don't you? <laughs> no. Uh, of course not. Never heard of him. Whoa! You call yourself a lawyer, bro. About four years ago, I grew up the prosecutor of A20. Everyone says he's a genius. Surprised you don't know him. Uh, of course I know him. I was just saying dumb. He's a cold-hearted machine. Don't do anything to get a guilty verdict. There are rumors of back alley deals for evidence. All I know for sure is that Edward hates crimes with almost an abnormal passion. I've never imagined I'd be facing him so soon. Oh gosh. This not good. Um present. Um I don't know if I should do anything. I was wondering, do you know anything about this? The statue, that's the murder weapon. Hmm? He thinks the clock is the statue too. I'm starting to wish I've never seen the stick. There was broken glass at the crime scene, right? Mm hmm? Oh, that? It seems like a glass stand next to the victim fell over. Glass shards and pieces broke at the stand. There was a piece of paper next to the victim, wasn't there? Yeah. Don't want the killer's name wrote on it. Are you sure Mia wrote it herself? Given her condition of writing, it's hard to say if it's a her handwriting or not. So there's no proof that Mia wrote it. Maybe this? I was wondering, did you see Mia's cell phone? Oh, that? I have that. You think you could give it back? Sure. I mean, wait a second, pal. Tricky lawyer. Uh-oh. He's on me. Save it here instead. When I tell him why I want it, there's no way he'll give it to me. Oh, okay, well, I guess we're loading. <laughs> I mean, I'm gonna do this a lot. Tell him not so straight. Okay, I can't be straight with this guy. But what should I tell him? Something matter? Oh, no, um. Th that carrying strapped on the cell phone. This. Mm. It says, the Steel Samurai, warrior of Neo Old Tokyo. Steel Samurai? Is that action here on TV? Yeah. You see the strap is a collector's item. She was worried that it might get lost if it went down to the pranked in it. That's what she said? Um, yes. Okay, pal. I wrote down all the numbers she called anyways. Here you go. Seems you didn't notice the record recorded conversation. Well, it's a conversation between Chief and Maya. Okay. Check the court record to hear the recording conversation. I guess I've asked all the questions I need to. You all done, pal? Um, yes. Thank you. I'll be heading out now. Oh, wait. One more thing I wanted to mention to you. I don't suppose you're planning on talking to the witness. Anyways, you better not. No influence in the witness with your lawyerly ways, pal. I think about it, I have completely forgotten about her. The witness. Yeah, Miss April May. Sorry about this. But I can't tell you anything about her. Well, she just told me her name. Miss May, huh? So you've sent her home for a reason. <laughs> You're trying your lord over these tricks on me now. She's not she's not to go outside her room until the trial. So she's still in the whole house after I guess I should know better than to try to you <laughs> get a detective to leak information. You've got that right, pal. 
Dumb papers in the Now I can go back. Great Water Hotel. Uh, how long is this video getting? Uh, um, well, we got an investigation then. And now we're going to this room. I think that's enough for this episode. I don't want these to get too long. Because then people tend to be like, eh, it's too long, I don't want to watch. But, um, we're not really editing these too much except for, like, adding outros. And maybe the first episode, maybe by the end I'm going to edit it. I don't know yet. <laughs> I haven't edited it yet. Um, I already forgot my sentence. <laughs> um, anyways, we will continue on from here next time, and I'll see you all next video.